Welcome, classic snowmobilers. This again is another example of a classic snowmobile, uh, uh, rather than vintage or antique. And today I'm wearing an Arctic Hat jacket, because we'll be talking about an Arctic Hat. Now the year, 1993. The model Thundercat. What a great marketing ploy to call this beast a Thundercat. Now, this goes back to the days when the horsepower wars were just beginning, okay? Yamaha had come up with a four-cylinder go-fast in 20, excuse me, 1992. In 1993, Skidoo, Polaris, and this was the entry for the Arctic Cat. Now, Thundercat was a great name, uh, quite frankly, they wanted to put an exclamation point on this lake racer genre, this muscle sled, this triple-triple era. Uh, the president of Articat at the time said, look, you either lead, you follow, or get out of our way. <laughs> so they were confident that this, this guy was gonna, was gonna make an impact. It brought their best technology and latest uh, innovations to, uh, to the proverbial horse power race. Beautiful machine. Now, as, 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 as fit the trend, there's, uh, there's, uh, there's tones of orange and a little bit of purple. You know, so this was a, de a departure in terms of the coloration, but it fit the fashion of the day. So let's open the hood here and look at what uh, Articat did. See the displacement? One, two, three cylinders, but this is 900, 900 cc's at a time when uh, the others coming to the game either had 750 or 800 cc displacement. So Arctic Cat was going to make a bold statement with this machine. Uh, three cylinders and three pipes here. There are uh, three uh, 38 millimeter Makuni uh, carburetors on this thing. And, uh, and uh, quite frankly, there was a lot of people in the aftermarket who were, who were just dying to see this because they knew it had greater potential. Uh, in the next uh, years, there was a lot of hop-up kits, etc. Now, that's not the purpose for this snowmobile or my, dis you know, this, this machine. I wanted to represent an original, an original machine here that uh, that kind of you know as as factory delivered. I, I I'm very close here in in uh, in this regard to uh, a correct uh, and original uh, machine here. Um, here we go. Let's uh, take a look at the dashboard here. Um, the gauges here. This one is showing 1,150 miles, and uh, and. Uh, so it hasn't been ridden that much, hasn't been ridden that much. It's not perfect by any means, but it's a beautiful, uh, I think, example of a period correct uh, a piece. Um, so uh, so Articat came to the table. Uh, they, uh, they trumped everybody with this big 900cc motor. And, uh, and uh, they're, they're, they're highly collectible. And uh, quite frankly, I'm proud to, uh, to have it in the stable. So that's a little bit about uh, about this Thundercat here. There are some changes that I've made. Come on around to the front here. Uh, this thing is kind of dressed up. See these grills? You could uh, you could buy them in in this uh, orange color. So I decided to go that route. If you look at here down at the skid, you'll see uh, uh, again orange Hyfax. Uh, uh, so uh, so that's uh, that's the program here, and. Uh, I just wanted to introduce you a bit to this uh, this thing, and uh, and have you take a peek. Hope you learned something. Bye. -bye. Ha, ha, ha.